You can you remember what I was going to talk about? Oh, <laughs> we get your legs wrapped up. <laughs> you need this part up. You need this part up. That way I can get your leg out. There you go. Go for it. Go for it. Step up. There you go. Uh, I think at one point this morning I was thinking, so all these kids getting all the screen, screen time is, it's a good and bad thing, right? The bad thing is you can't trust anything that's on the internet. So you have to teach your kid that half of it is bullshit. But the good thing is I see a lot of, like, younger kids that are just really good in front of the camera, right? And it's because they've been doing it a lot. Like, uh, a while back, I was like, man, nobody wants to see this damn shit with your stupid kid. Just because I'm uh, an asshole. Maybe a little jealous. People having kids. Who knows? I wasn't, uh, I wasn't living the life that's good for having a kid. <laughs> Although maybe that would have changed me, right? It changes some people, some people don't. But anyways, uh, anyways, these kids grow up and there's so many people that are just good sitting in front of their camera making videos. And that's how the world is, right? Where it used to be very few people were really good at it and they became your TV stars. And some people were kind of good at it, so they became your commercial people. And some people were just no good at it, and they wanted to be it. And their parents never told them they didn't have no talent, so they thought they could. <laughs> you got to be straight with your kids. Look, man, you ain't good at that. You keep working on it, but let's find something else for you, too. But anyways, that's one thing that I can't do, right? I was never good at the public speaking thing. So when I do this kind of stuff, my brain's all over the place. I think that's why I never really tried on it. But even when I try to work it out, try it. And uh, like I had to do meetings for automotive when I was a production supervisor. And uh, I would have a whole thing to go down. I didn't want to take the piece of paper up in front of me, which I probably should have. But I would talk, talk it out, right? And where you see the turtle? I would try to talk it out because that's what they say to do. Talk it out so you get it in your head. But for me, when I talk it out, man, now it's out of there. If I say it once, I can't say it again. I would have to have a full script to do good because my brain, my brain doesn't work linear because I'm a goofer. I should probably be on Adderall. Although, when I was taking Adderall, you know, uh, what is it? Um, what's the word for it, dude? Just for fun? Um, God, dude, how come I can't think of that word? Because I didn't need it. It was, uh, of course, it might have been because of how much I took, too. But for people that don't need it, it's like being on coke. <laughs> what recreationally? I took it recreationally. That's the word. I probably could have used it. Everybody was on it. It's like everything, right? The doctors make it a crutch. Oh, you're hyper. Let me give you ADD medication. Oh, you got this. Let me give you this medication. Let me give you this medication. Anyways, whatever. I was always just a hyperactive kid, though. Even as an old man, I got to be moving all the time. Now, once I sit down now, I used to would sit down and I would get antsy. I'd be like, dude, I got to do something. Whether I was on drugs or not. <clears throat> now it's like, as soon as I sit down, oh, break time. Give me a couple hours. As long as I keep moving, I'm good. Once I sit down and stop. Anyways. <clears throat> Most people on pills don't need pills. What are you doing, weirdo? 
Uh, look at all the ducks are up and moving. All right, we're out of here. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, I talked to an old friend of mine last night. Man, I used to be a funny ass dude. Do some crazy shit. Makes me think of how much of an old fluddy duddy I am now. I've lost my entertainment value. Even on these things, I used to say a couple things. I used to try to be informative and also a little bit of entertaining, right? A little bit of funny. If you're only informative, it's boring, at least to me. Some people are great with that. For me, there has to be a little, a little chuckle every here and there. All right, out of here.